St. Peter welcomes a new business to town, the Paddlefish Brewery. Kyla Jackson takes us to today's grand opening. It's day one for the Paddlefish Brewery on South Minnesota Avenue in St. Peter. The grand opening drew a crowd. It's a good atmosphere. I absolutely love it. Dave Long and two other co-owners put in a year and a half of work to make the Paddlefish Brewery come to life. It's been, it's been a dream come true to see this place thrive like it is today. We've had a few soft openings to kind of get our staff up to speed with, uh, with our point of sale system and, and just their training. They've had local artists work on everything within the brewery, like the tables, the table bases, the art installation, and even the paddlefish has a special meaning in St. Peter. I came across an article of a guy holding a giant paddlefish just right over here on the 99 bridge. And you don't catch them, you, you snag them. The brewery offers more than just beer. Uh, I am drinking the on the road again sour. They also offer mocktails for people who don't drink alcohol, along with seltzers, kombucha, and root beer on tap at an establishment that shows St. Peter and breweries are growing. It's a good place to see the new brewery today in St. Peter. It's, I was born and raised here. I'm from Mankato. I moved here to St. Peter two years ago. And I absolutely love being here in St. Peter. When they didn't have a brewery and now they have a brewery, I live right up the street. Something down the road to look forward to. This spring and summer, Paddlefish Brewery plans to bring food trucks to draw a crowd. Oh, for sure. I'll be back many times. In St. Peter, Kyla Jackson, KEYC News Now. Well, if you loved the grand opening for the Paddlefish Brewery, stay tuned for the other brewery coming to the St. Peter community soon. It'll be located in the old firehouse.